Thank you. It's good that we have a little bit of mild weather this morning because one group called Worthwhile Go is taking on the challenge of raising awareness about human trafficking, and they're doing it in a really unique way. They're biking across the country, including biking across New Mexico. We got them on part of their trip here across the state this morning. Jay Atlas and Sylvester Williams are on one of their tours. Here they come biking up. They're going to be talking with us about this. Are coming through Albuquerque today. It's good to have both of you gentlemen. Nice to have you here. Let's talk a little bit about your effort and exactly what you're hoping to raise awareness about while you're here in New Mexico. Great. Uh, so one of the things we want to do is uh, we want to talk to people about human trafficking and what that looks like here specifically. Uh, there's no demographic for it. So we're trying to find out uh, the differences between say human trafficking here or Denver or Pennsylvania where we're from. How far has your trip taken you so far? So far we're about 2,500 miles in, uh, but we are over 10,000 miles in total. By the close of this tour, we'll have 12,800 miles logged. That's an incredible amount of distance. And across New Mexico alone is, is a pretty big distance. Let's, let's, let me ask you this. Why human trafficking? Why raise awareness about that? Um, no one should be held against their will in, in any way. Uh, I mean, we have the freedom, especially in America, to, to do whatever we want to. So for just any type of human being to be held against their will is, is, is just tragic and it hurts the heart. So if we can do in any way, raise some type of awareness about that and help out, we, we're all for it. How many tours have you done? Uh, all together, we're on our third tour. First tour was from Atlantic City to Los Angeles. Last year was Seattle to Miami, and this year is Fargo, North Dakota to San Antonio, Texas. All right, we're looking at some video right now of yeah. you guys as you as you do make your trek across the country. Tell me about New Mexico and how it's affected by this issue and why you chose to ride here. Uh, well, it is Jay, right? Yes, Jay. Jay. Yeah. Uh, so there was a gentleman by the name of Carson here, uh, and uh, this is a more recent news. Uh, he just got put into prison for at least 33 years. Uh, he'll probably go in for an additional 64 for repeat offending, but he was trafficking a 17-year-old girl that he took from a bus stop and then a 21-year-old actually from San Antonio and claimed their uh, cell phones and money and their identities and just told them that you know they work for him now. Mm. Which obviously is something that everybody can kind of connect with on an emotional level. Right. You know, something we don't want to see. All right, Sylvester, tell me about the event that you have today to talk about all this. Yes, we're actually going to be meeting up with New Mex University of Mexico, and we'll have um, over three organizations there that we'll team up with and uh, just learn more education on what it looks like in New Mexico, and so we can bring that back to Pennsylvania as well because it looks differently everywhere you go. So the more education, the more awareness we can uh, raise, you know, the more effective and efficient we can be. All right, give me a time, location, and details on that so if somebody wants to go, they can get there. Oh, University of Mexico, Jay, I'm sorry, he would help you out. He has more details on that. Yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry that. Okay. It, uh, it'll be at 2 p.m. today. Okay. We'll be on the campus, and we'll, we'll walk around throughout the campus. I know the campus is fairly large, but we'll be down uh, down towards like the main uh, in the main center. Okay. Easy enough for folks to find 2 p.m. this afternoon. Where are you off to next? Uh, we're headed to San Antonio ultimately, but our next big stop will be uh, Clovis and then Lubbock. Okay. So we'll head out through Santa Rosa, Klein's Corner. Be safe as you do bike. Jay, we appreciate it. Sylvester, thanks so much. I know you guys are headed out on your next leg, so take it away. I'm going to let you uh, travel here as you uh, bike off and remind you again about that event this afternoon and uh, their effort to bike and raise awareness for human trafficking. Thanks, thanks gentlemen. We appreciate it. We'll uh, send it over to Chad and Brittany. you got to look at what's coming up at the top of the hour, right?